Muy buenas a YouTube, bienvenidos a un nuevo vídeo de Triangle Strategy. Continuamos, estamos en la ciudad capital de la Sacra Sede. Para Zareir, la reputación de Sostulo Ende, Serena debería ya hallar una prueba irrefutable de sus fechorías. En Perú el tiempo se agota. Eh, queremos acusarlo del comercio de la sal, ¿vale? Después de como amenazarnos de alguna manera. Después de la amenaza de aquí de, del ejército de Fraguelada y demás, pues no tenemos aliados. Y entonces, vamos primero aquí arriba. A los maestros Sóstulo y Caligia discurren cierto asunto en la fortaleza de Cauce Arenal. ¿Qué tendrán que tratar allí? Vamos a ver qué es. Primero y después vamos a la, a la misión. Well, if it isn't tenebrous, gloomy as ever, I see. Minister Sorsley, I see you are in high spirit. And why shouldn't I be? House Wolfort is ferrying my salt as we speak. An illustrious house from the Salt Iron War trying to win my favor. It's laughable. But can they succeed, being as ignorant to the circumstances as they are? If they fail, I simply lay the blame upon them and see their house duly punished. I shall gain merit in place of money. <laughs> I did not take you for an optimist. Or have you forgotten of Exham and Camsell's suspicions? You speak as if it were my problem alone, my dear Tenebris. Do not misunderstand. It is because we are tarred with the same brush that I have come to warn you. Your dealings of late have grown, perhaps overly so. You would make an enemy of the other saints, should they notice. And would you too turn against me, Tenebris? Um, most certainly not. Our fates are tied. Good. Now leave me. Pray, be careful, Minister. What need have I for caution? I have never failed. Vale, pues vamos a la capital. Sorsley may well come to end us once he hears of our allegations. There is no turning back now. We must move swiftly. So how shall we proceed? We must provide hard evidence as Minister Camsell requested. And I wish to be named Archduke of Esfrost. Does he understand what he asks of us? We have no leads. Salt is a well-regulated commodity, and numbers do not lie. If this illicit trade exists, someone will have altered the ledgers. Of course. We'll gather what information we can on Sorsley until the evidence we seek reveals itself. Let us canvas the town and see what we find. Agreed. We should split up and search for clues. Tenemos que reunir testimonios para evidenciar el crimen de Sostulo. Ay, ¿qué quiere usted? No tengo tiempo para darle el palique. Estoy intentando que la guardia me pierda el rastro. A ver si se largan y puedo irme a casa. Hay cositas por aquí. Ha brillado. Y no lo he visto. Ahora miramos. Eh... Aquí. Eh, Fármaco de curación. Vale. Bueno, vamos a ir. Vale, ahí, ahí, ahí. 
Vale, antisueño. Están pululando noticias de Glaucoburgo. Parece que Estragolada ha tomado el país. El rey se ha estado comportando de forma deshonesta. Eso es lo que pasa cuando no se tiene fe en la diosa. Clarus, contrabando, ¿dónde habéis oído semejante historia? Por la diosa, qué disparate. ¿Tenéis alguna prueba de ello? Ninguna. Cuando se hacen negocios a gran escala como el nuestro, se dan rumores extraños. Os pido que dudéis de toda información que os llegue. Si hay rumores de tráfico ilícito, es mi deber investigarlo. Si te topas con alguna novedad, házmelo saber, estaré encantado de ayudarte. Uh, 1300 moneditas. Ey, ey, ey. Los sitios ungidos han sido elegidos por la diosa de la sal para guiar a los fieles. En la cima se encuentra su eminencia, quien puede escuchar la voz de la diosa. Su eminencia entonces le confía a los sitios ungidos la labor de transmitir a los fieles la voluntad de la diosa y así como este país se colma de bendiciones. ¿Qué opinión le merece nuestro extenso sistema tan diferente al de otros países? A nosotros nos llena de orgullo. Si no tiene sus ventajas, pero también sus defectos, tengo mis reticencias o oh, pintarlo de excelso. Poco lo distingue de otros, a su eminencia le percibo como un soberano y cada ungidor no difiere mucho de un consejero. Los sistemas de cada país son producto de su historia y de su gente. Me parece un graso error a comparar tan a la ligera. Le pido que no nos compare con otros países, no tenemos absolutamente nada que ver. Los siete ungidos son fieles como nosotros y defienden el credo de la diosa a capa y espada. No se mueven por el egoísmo como los nobles de otros lugares. Guían al pueblo siguiendo la palabra manifiesta de la diosa. Tiene teoría, aunque me pregunto cuántos siguen a pies puntillas el credo. ¿Qué le trae la corte médica? Si no tiene una razón de peso, le ruego que se extinga de entrar. Si no se puede entrar, ¿no? Laila, parece que mi secretaria está investigando al maestro Sóstulo, debería de haber dejado los detalles de las pesquisas en su diario. Leedlo si encontráis, si lo encontráis, estoy seguro de que tenéis la bendición de la diosa para sacar a reducir la verdad. El mariscal es arme, no se encuentra aquí ahora, puede dejarme un mensaje por escrito si lo desea. ¿Un mensaje? Necesitaría algo para poder escribir. Solo gente autorizada puede acceder a la basílica. Le ruego que se marche. Sí, aquí me venía a buscar algo. ¿No? No. Fármaco. En esta parte no se permite la entrada de visitantes. No sé quién es usted o de dónde viene, pero no puedo permitir el acceso a la fontana de la sala. Pregúnteme lo que quiera, pero olvídese de entrar a la fontana. Y pues órdenes de arriba y son las frutas. Debo pedirle que se vaya y déjeme cumplir con mis funciones. No me dejaré entrar. ¿Hay algo ahí? No me lo dan. Ahí, madera de calidad. Nos han llegado informes acerca de, su, de un hereje en esta zona. Porque el ciudadano no lo habrá visto. Están buscando un hereje si ayudo a aquel hombre. La par podría facilitarme alguna información. No, no lo he visto. Hay una mujer que vive cerca de la corte médica a la que pierran los cotillos. Si pasa el día y la noche que se corriendo. No tiene remedio. Iría a preguntarle, que siempre está al día de nuevos chismes. Una mujer a la que le encantan los cotillos, iría a preguntarle qué ha habido últimamente. Si no se puede. Me queda este. Pragolada es un país bárbaro que hace alarde de su libertad, pero donde impera la ley de los poderosos y acaudalados. En cambio, Dunalgia es una tierra donde todos los creyentes conviven en igualdad y armonía bajo la bendición de la diosa. No hace falta ni preguntarlo, pero ¿qué país cree que es mejor? La libertad es esencial para el ser humano. 
pienso que Fragolado va por el camino correcto. No. El deber de un líder es llevar igualdad y paz a su pueblo. Creo que tenemos mucho que aprender de Donaxia. Nah. Estoy convencido de que el país al que sirvo, Locoburgo, es el mejor posible. Por esto mismo. Para contentar a todos. Muy cierto, muy cierto. Veo que entiende lo magnánimo del credo de la diosa. Sin embargo, tengo entendido que no todos los de Donaxia son iguales. ¿No crees que debería reconsiderar la forma que traéis a la Rose? Acaba usted de pecar de este tipo. Debe saber que son los creyentes más devotos. Podemos recibir la bendición de la diosa. Las Rus no son un pueblo incrédulo, sino que son pecadores de la peor calaña. Tratarlos de igual a igual sería un grave insulto a la diosa. Le advierto que tales ideas no solo despertarán la ira de la diosa. Interesante, ahora comprendo mejor cómo piensan los fieles de unar un ricos. Ha hecho una mujer por aquí. Hay una casita. Me han dicho que esto es muy favorito con los rumores que corren por aquí. Me gustaría saber lo último que haya oído. Uy, usted es de los míos. Pregunte, pregunte. Vamos, algo jugoso. Esta es una buena. He oído hablar del navío mercantil que desaparece en la mitad de la noche. Se cuela en el puerto como si nada y luego desaparece. No da tiempo ni a pestañear. Un navío mercantil que desaparece en mitad de la noche. La verdad es que no tenía entendida de cómo sacaban el sal del puerto. Podrían estar usando ese navío. He obtenido información. Esta mujer no tiene nada más por aquí. ¿Cómo me puede llevar? Vale, me ha dicho este si habría algo. ¿Contrabando? ¿Dónde ha oído semejante historia? ¡Eh! Vamos a las casas. Aquí hemos entrado, ¿no? El libro. Es el libro de no, vale. Ya ha recabado toda la información. Eh, ¿Hablo con este o hablo con el de arriba? Bueno, este no desbloquea nada. No te desconozco cómo se relaciona con lo que trabajando la sala, deberíamos aclararlo. Si se lo doy a este. No, pesquisas. Bueno, volver al campamento para hacer un balance de la información que conozco hasta ahora. What news? Have you learned anything? Nothing can remain hidden indefinitely. A thorough review of the testimony shall show us the truth. Benedict is right. Let us review what we know to be true. Lord Serenoa, what does the evidence at hand suggest? Let us begin with Sorcelay himself. What is his crime? Me ha traído. La red de sobornos en las altas esferas de Glaucoburgo. Ah, dos están untados, vamos, me puedo decir cualquier cosa. He bribed nobles right under our noses in Glenbrook. How could I have been so blind to his dealings in the upper echelons of my own kingdom? Though we know this to be true, I doubt we'll build a worthy case now that Esfrost rules the Crown City. If we cannot secure the help of the remaining saints, We've no choice but to present our case directly to the Hierophant. 
doing so will require incontrovertible proof of source lay's improprieties. Incontrovertible proof that we lack, unfortunately. Then, we must prepare to face charges of false accusation. Now then, let us focus on where we might find the evidence we need. So, we'll find the vanished cargo ship. How do you propose we find something that vanished without a trace? Sus Might the bribe sourcely ply Glenbrook's nobles with be connected to his illicit dealings? The trouble remains that we've got no proof of anything. The vanished cargo ship is suspicious, yes, but we'll not find an unmoored vessel. Yeah, it's not that we demonstrate. Despite our best efforts, I'm afraid we haven't evidence enough to confront him over his crimes. And Sorsley will find us out soon enough, if he hasn't already. Time is of the essence, then. What is our next move? We're... Okay, that other. Though we lack proof, we'd best raise the issue with Camsell once more. A la sombra de sospecha, fin. Hemos logrado lo que buscábamos. Serenoa and his retinue know House End is involved in the illicit salt trade, yet fail to secure any solid evidence to back up their claims. Their position growing tenuous. House Wolfort makes a reckless bid to persuade Kamsal, Minister of Domestic Affairs, to levy charges. Por merced, no preguntes. Minister Kamsal will join our cause, won't he? It's hard to be sure, but we must press our case and have faith. That is. Uh oh. You! Are you House End's dogs? A messenger, my lord, from the palace. I seek Lord Serenoa Wolfort. You have found him. Lord Wolfort, you have been accused of coercing Minister Sorcelay End unto unlawful acts. Presence is required at the palace, so the Holy One may question you. How send is the guilty party, not Saranoa. If you've testimony to give, you are welcome to stand witness at the trial. My lord, this may be a good opportunity to bring our case directly to the Hierophant and the other powerful entities of Hyzen. I expect the Saintly Seven are not of one mind on this matter. If you can persuade some of the ministers to side with us, Sorcelay will have nowhere to run. Perhaps. Or you could end up the one with his head on the chopping block, Saranoa. Even so, we cannot make an enemy of Hyzant, else we truly will be alone. I must stand trial, plead my case to the Holy One and the Saintly Seven, and hope that they believe me. No queda otra. No va a hacer pelearnos con todo el mundo. Vale, tenemos dos misiones aquí. El resto del mundo. No hay ningún movimiento. El oráculo ha hecho un llamamiento para las siete búsquedas. Me... Hay diez personajes, hay personajes. Lo he visto.
You've been summoned to the palace, Minister Kamsel. The Holy One is to hear the accusations against Minister End and question House Wolf. Very well. So, Sorsley has made the first move. Serenora must not have been able to secure evidence against him after. But order cannot truly be restored simply by sentencing House Wolfort. I must make of this opportunity what I can. So there is to be a trial. I see. The Holy One requires the presence of the Saintly Seven immediately. And here I thought you nearly had him, Wolfort. Did I overestimate you? No matter. There is more than one way to trap a greedy boar. Now then, who will be best put to the task? Tal vez han de hacer. Vamos con los personajes. Le daré su lugar de polvor y hoy carcajadas, pero su patrona hoy no está por la labor. Sus pilotas subieron algo que ha sucedido. Vamos a ver. What is the realm coming to? Hail, fair maid! Well, if it is an Arador, have a seat. Who are you and what have you done with the barkeep? <laughs> the one I know ain't prone to melancholy. She is when word of a fellow barkeep's misfortunes reaches her. It's all in this letter. People are taken to plunder and to survive this war. Here's hoping your fine establishment escapes unscathed. I, I can't bear to think of what I'd do without this place. My heart goes out to you. As if times weren't hard enough with customers. <sighs> I can't think straight for worrying so much. Well, you're a soldier, aren't you? Can't you just go out there and crush your enemies so we can be done with all this? <laughs> if only it were so easy. What I wouldn't give to wield a flagon every day instead of a blade. Never took you for the type to make excuses, Eridor. Eridor is doing everything he can. The realm suffers because of my failings. Forgive me, Lord Wolfort. It was hard. What with things being as they are, I haven't been my. But enough of this. All the moping in the world won't change a thing. It's time for it. My lord, as you can see, I'll have no choice but to shutter my tavern if the war doesn't... So let me join you. I think you'll find that pouring ale isn't the only trick I have up my sleeve. Ah, but where are my manners? Hasabara's the name, my lord. At your service. A barkeep I may be, but good drink isn't the only way I know how to heal what ails me. I can vouch for that, my lord. Hasabara is good to have around in a pinch. <laughs> then I see no reason to refuse. You are most welcome among us. Ha! Heartening to see you're the decisive. And you've made a good decision as well. Couldn't have picked. Aye. I gathered that the way you're always singing his praises. Hasabara en el grupo. Ahora vamos a ver el otro. Una joven practicante de la corte médica de la sacra sede de Donagia reflexiona sobre las vidas humanas. It's an emergency. We have two patients. Both with extraordinary fevers. The Rosellen is unresponsive. Well, I can't tend to both unless you can give me two more pairs of arms. 
Let me help. I've just completed my training and I'll do whatever it takes to save them. Are there no real doctors left? Uh, fine, come. We're losing precious time. Leave the Rosellen. We must prioritize the Believer. As you wish. But the Rosellen will die unless we do something. Do they not teach the order of things in school these days? So what if they do? What does the order of things have to do with saving lives? Not all lives are weighted the same. You would do well to remember that. Quickly, Medina, these people are dying as we bicker. <sighs> I couldn't save him. Orders or not, I was the one following them. It's all my fault. Where are you going? Medina! Ahí está. I beg your pardon, Lord Saranoa, but a doctor from the ministry. My name is Medina. I've heard much about your house and simply had to see. What insolence is this? Stand down. Pray tell, what brings you. It is said House Wolfert possesses a relic known as the Scales of Conviction. Is this. It is. We turn to the scales for guidance in times of trouble. Then. I wonder if they might guide me forward as well. I... I had a crisis of confidence. A man was counting on me to save his... I cannot let this happen again. I wish to save all the lives I can, regardless of country or... Pray grant me the chance to consult the scales, that I might walk the righteous path. The scales are merely a tool to an end. They are not a magical window into the future. When decisions must be made, all in this house have a say. We choose as best we're able and strive to ensure we chose wisely. You mean you strive not to regret your decision? That is all one can do. Forgive me if this is not the answer you sought. Then, would House Wolford accept my aid if I offered it, my lord? If you would serve as a physician, that would be a boon. For we fear the war is far from over. I would be honored, my lord. I would see what I could do to rewrite the order of things. Then let us walk the path together. I am at your service, my lord. Esta sí que la podríamos poner en el grupo, ¿eh? Si vamos a Yela. Yela te estás jugando el puesto. Porque si cura. Vamos allá. The inquiry of House Wolford. Stood accused by Minister Sorsley End will hereby commence. We of the Saintly Seven will preside over this trial. Serenor Wolford, you stand before the Holy One. Do you swear by the Goddess to speak the truth? I swear. Cuando la pregunta es, en el sitio de un juego se demuestra que Sostro Ende es culpable. Minister Exham Marshall, you may begin the proceedings. We know Minister Sorsley quite well, having worked with him for these long years. But we know comparatively little of you, Lord Saranoa. 
Therefore, we must first determine whether you are worthy of our trust. Surely you have not forgotten his position among the saintly seven of the holy state of Hyzant? I would never forget, but... Then why do you lay these accusations at Sorsley's feet? As one of the saintly seven, he speaks with the voice of the goddess herself. Your actions undermine the goddess's ordained order. I have nothing further to ask. Next, Minister Kamsel Farrant will make his inquiries. You must understand the difficult position you have put us in, sauntering into our home to denounce one of our own. We are a welcoming people, and so must be wary of those who seek to take advantage of our open hearts. If a stranger came to you with unfounded accusations against one of your people, I... Have you any proof of the foul deeds you claim have taken place no. in our land? El barco desaparece. Confirmo que hay una red ilegal de tráfico de sal. Sí, pero no hay pruebas. Pero... I've heard of a cargo vessel disappearing from the port in the middle of the night. It's possible it was carrying unlawful salt. You present, as your evidence, another rumor, and one from an anonymous source at that. Is it customary where you are from to condemn a man based on gossip alone? I think not. I have nothing more to ask. <laughs> Minister Tenebris, if you would. It isn't strange that lay people would fail to grasp the goddess's infinite wisdom. We seven, however do understand her will. For most, our teachings are the only way they know how to live according to her plan. It is moot to judge Sorsley, one of the seven, based on evidence brought against him by a lay person, no matter what that evidence may be. Unless you have testimony from one who understands the goddess's will, there is simply nothing we can do. ¿Qué testigo tengo? La esclava lo dice. Sorsley met in secret with powerful Glenbrook officials and bribed them. Minister Lila's secretary can attest to this. Oh? A secretary to one of the saintly seven, you say? My secretary's word is as good as my own. None is more devoted to the goddess than he. I see. Well, I cannot argue against that. I have no further questions. Minister Lila Viscraft, ask your questions. It is plain to me that Sorsley has indeed engaged in misconduct, namely bribery. Yet while I do not doubt he bribed an official of Glenbrook, what the bribe was for remains unclear. Perhaps you can shine some light on the matter, Lord Serenoa. El silencio cómplice para ocultar la escasa salida de la sal. El cómplice para ocultar el navío mercantil de la noche. The ship that disappeared in the night must have been carrying unlawful salt. He'd have wanted to keep that quiet. Yet rumor of such a ship has reached even my ears. Would it not be an utter waste of coin to buy a single person's silence when so many have already heard the gossip? I have no more questions. I, Edor Delmira, will ask one final round of questions. I cannot deny, Lord Serenoa, that Sorsley can be foolish. But he is also dedicated to the goddess. And he has worked much good as one of the seven. Though he is not faultless by any means, 
If we are to pass judgment on such a man, we must prove his guilt. So let me ask you this, Sereno Woolford. Where exactly are we to find such evidence against Sorsley and... We could find nothing in town, so there must be something here in the palace. In this palace, where we live and work beneath the ever-watchful gaze of the goddess herself. How disappointing, Serenoa Wolfort, <laughs> that you still do not grasp the extent of her divine. Madam. My questions are done. Now we will confer with one another. The Holy One will pass judgment after hearing our opinions. Saranora Woolfort, the Holy One has passed judgment. House Woolfort was found to have spoken untrue. You brought baseless accusations against the most exalted sorcery end of the saintly seven and sullied his good name. Such blasphemous actions cannot go unpunished. Wait, we meant no insult against the goddess. Luckily for you, her mercy extends even to heretics. You have one chance to atone. Face Sorcery's forces in battle and emerge the victor. What? Let whomsoever earns the goddess's divine grace be cleansed of all sin. Batalla. Nivel recomendado 16. Uf. Lo voy a dejar aquí. Ha sido una chapa bastante larga. La verdad. Estos son capítulos así de, de hablar. Es, cuesta un poquito prestar atención y más con la calor que está pegando ahora. Espero que os haya gustado este vídeo. Si like, like, suscribiros al canal para más. Y continuamos la aventura de Serenoa. Estamos en un atolladero bastante importante. No sé cómo vamos a salir de este, de este tema, pero esperemos que bien. El siguiente combate, nivel recomendado 16. Nos vemos pronto.